When we talk about electric cars, the first name that comes to mind is Tesla. But what if I told you that Hyundai has already turned the technology of the future, not electric, but hydrogen-powered cars, into reality? Yes, you heard that right. The 2026 Hyundai Nexo is a fully hydrogen-powered SUV designed for families. It's packed with various features and, most importantly, it's affordable. In this video, we'll talk about how the 2026 Hyundai Nexo is revolutionizing the hydrogen vehicle market. We'll also touch on Elon Musk's reaction and whether this vehicle will be released in the US and Europe. So sit closer to the screen because exciting moments await. After introducing the new hydrogen-powered SUV model, the Hyundai Nexo 2026, the manufacturer also announced its intention to further expand the Nexo family, which will involve the launch of various compact SUV models. At the 2018 Beijing International Automotive Exhibition, Hyundai unveiled two new hydrogen vehicles, the Hyundai Nexo and the Hyundai Initium model. Taking a step no one expected, Hyundai made its first move into the hydrogen vehicle market by unveiling the Nexo 2026 at the 2024 Beijing Auto Show. And as promised, sales of this fully hydrogen-powered model will begin in January 2026. For now, this model will be available only in South Korea. You might ask, why? Because the vehicle is entirely manufactured in South Korea. It may be introduced to other markets in the future, but we'll get to that later. By partnering with the GAC Group, Hyundai has introduced this impressive innovation with the ambition to surpass Tesla. This time, Hyundai has truly outdone itself, starting at just $20,800. This model has already become a favorite among buyers. The Hyundai Nexo 2026 is presented as a family car. Reminiscent of the RAV4, but fully hydrogen-powered, this compact SUV features a spacious interior, a comfortable cabin, and advanced technologies. Taking into account drivers' complaints about touchscreens, Hyundai has equipped some functions with physical buttons. For example, volume and climate controls are available as physical controls. The driving range of this model is also impressive. It can cover between 570 and 620 kilometers. 354 to 385 miles. Thanks to its fast refueling capability, it takes just five minutes to go from 30% to 100%. One of the strongest features of the vehicle is its AI-powered driver assistance system. This system operates using LiDAR technology, which scans the car's surroundings in 360 degrees, detecting pedestrians, other vehicles, lane markings, and obstacles. With 11 high-resolution cameras and 27 sensors, the Hyundai Nexo 2026 can change lanes on its own, park itself, brake during collisions, and even read traffic lights. In short, this vehicle is ambitious enough to shake up the EV market. But how are other automakers responding to it, especially Elon Musk? Things aren't going well at Tesla. In fact, they seem to be getting worse. According to sources close to the matter, Hyundai's bold move has seriously caught Elon Musk off guard. Recently, Elon Musk and the CEOs of Hyundai and the Nexo 2026 project reportedly met to discuss the possibility of future collaboration. The idea of a partnership wasn't entirely far-fetched, as the two companies have worked together in the past. However, Hyundai's CEO, Koji Sato, wasn't looking for collaboration. Instead, he tried to explain to Musk what EV manufacturers need to focus on to produce more durable and efficient batteries. He also clarified why Hyundai took its time before entering the electric vehicle market. The company needed to build its reputation over the years as a reliable and efficient automaker. And it succeeded. Tesla has always been a disruptive force in the electric vehicle industry. Hyundai, on the other hand, prefers to move more slowly and strategically. Automakers have long been under pressure to produce more environmentally friendly vehicles, and three decades ago, they were still far from that goal. So in 1997, Hyundai introduced its first mass-produced hybrid vehicle. At first, consumers didn't pay much attention to it, largely because fuel prices were low. But the fuel shortages of the early 2000s made this car extremely popular. Its hybrid design made it incredibly fuel efficient. Elon Musk has reasons to be concerned about Hyundai entering the electric vehicle market. 
Tesla's cheapest model, the Model 3, starts at $42,400 to $47,400, while the new Hyundai Nexo 2026 is priced at just $20,800. But since production is still happening exclusively in South Korea, why is Elon Musk so worried? And will this electric vehicle be released in the US and Europe? With the new tariffs now in effect, the situation is changing. The new tariffs imposed by President Trump on imports from South Korea are now in force, and as of yesterday, these tariffs have reached 145%. This increase could have a serious impact on the entry of South Korean-made vehicles, like the Hyundai Nexo 2026, into the U.S. market. Such a tariff burden could reduce Hyundai's price competitiveness and create additional costs for consumers. All of this is related to a combination of regulatory challenges, tariffs, and market strategies. The new Hyundai Nexo 2026 has not yet been released in the US or Europe. Let's first talk about the tariffs. As you know, this model is only produced in South Korea. However, the tense trade relations between the US and South Korea have significantly increased tariffs. This means that exporting this vehicle to America becomes costly, and as a result, American buyers are forced to purchase it at a higher price, which goes against Hyundai's goal of making it affordable. The situation in the European market is the same. There are tariffs of 25% to 30% on products imported from South Korea. In addition, the US and European regulatory standards also pose additional challenges for Hyundai. If the company wants to bring this hydrogen-powered vehicle to these regions, it would need to redesign it to meet the safety and production standards of those regions. For example, different countries in Europe have their own specific regulations regarding battery safety, electronic systems, and autonomous driving software. The simplest way to enter these markets without problems is to establish manufacturing plants there. However, this also requires significant financial investment. It seems that the Hyundai Nexo 2026 is primarily designed for the South Korean market, and it could take years before it is available in other regions. But there is hope. Hyundai has always been a company known for its strategic approach, and it has already developed plans for the US and European markets. The next generation version of the Nexo is already in development, and this model is specifically being designed for those regions. Hyundai has entered the EV market on its own terms and created a model that addresses most of the complaints from buyers. For example, buyers were unhappy with the high prices of electric vehicles. Hyundai Nexo 2026 is one of the most affordable hydrogen vehicles on the market. Concerns about long charging times have also been eliminated. This model features fast refueling capabilities. Worries about confusing control screens have been considered, and a traditional button interface has been retained. In other words, there is now no significant concern for consumers in making the switch to hydrogen-powered transportation. Perhaps this move will prompt politicians to reconsider the deadlines set for phasing out traditional gasoline-powered vehicles. South Korea will be an excellent example for tracking the success of this model. Could it be that the future we've been talking about for years has finally arrived? So, do you think Hyundai has truly taken the lead in this race? Will other automakers lower their prices? Share your thoughts with us in the comments, and don't forget to subscribe for more videos like this.